YouTubers, welcome to vlog number 100, 100, a tenth of a thousand, 99 more than one. It's giveaway time. I'll discuss the giveaway once I get to the club in a second. I've got my smoothie made with what we'll be giving away to one lucky contestant who enters the giveaway. I'll let you know how to enter it once I get to the club. Today's training, not too bad, a bit lighter like I thought yesterday was supposed to be due to two sessions and weights. Let's get straight to it with the smoothie, strawberry, banana, yogurt, milk, protein powder. See you at the club where I'm going to tell you about the giveaway. Okay. And we've made it to the club. Okay, giveaway. What you got to do is like and comment on this video and make sure you are subscribed. To make it as easy as possible, you can comment whatever you like. Perhaps you make it smoothie related because it is for a ninja blender. And I'll get that sent to you after the winner is chosen. Sunday, the competition will close for the giveaway and I'll choose the winner randomly and then we'll get that sent out to you hopefully next week. All right. Okay, so like, comment, and subscribe on this video, Vlog 100, and then I'll get in touch with you. We'll get in contact. I'll get your address, and I'll send you, get Ninja to send out that smoothie maker. Okay, let's get changed for the first session on the water. And we've made it to the crew room again on the 100 vlog day. Breakfast hasn't changed though, because remember, food is fuel. Eggs, eggs, sausage, brown sauce and toast. Did the bread. And I'm going to recover, eat this food, talk to some people in the crew room. And I've got 18K to do later on, on the row machine and weights too. Big day for 100 vlog day. Let's get to it. Just had an awesome breakfast in the crew room with the boys and the boys from the camp are trickling in. Great to see them. And it's really nice of Leander. They've, it's the bicentenary, 200 years, but they've also got me some balloons for the 100 vlog. Look at this. I think it's a one. Looks like a one. It is a one. That's a look at that. A hundred balloon. That's really nice of them. All right, let's go get some working out done. Yeah. And we're eating away at breakfast. And guess who doesn't finish theirs? Oh, it's cream, Cameron. You can't finish cream. What? Sam, so finish that cream. Did you order that for breakfast too? Yeah, I did. I did. And have you finished it? I'll do it now, just because I'm on camera. Sam, you watching? There we go. Right. All in one, or the whole thing. Okay. It's fulfilled oil. Food is fuel. Right. How's it taste? Don't record the next bit, I'm gonna check <laughs> it. Guys, remember, food is fuel, even a bowl of cream and an orange. All right, let's get to some Aragon. Okay, and you know what that means? It's a long workout, so that means it is Eric Thoughts time with Cam Buckin. Just myself today, a little bit of sped up footage just to get ready, and off we go. As you can see, just as we get there. 
Look at the state of me. Oh my goodness. So as you see, there's dripping on the floor. The floor is absolutely soaked. I might as well have put a paddling pool there and let the guys play in that because there was so much sweat going on. And as you'll see or hear, I'll talk about it after this, how much I lost during, how much weight I lost in fluid during this ergo. So it's 18K straight through, nice and easy at UT2 splits. And you're at the end of this bit. You'll see what splits I managed to hold a little faster than yesterday. Feeling good. But it was so hot in the gym today. Just as hot outside, humid, thunderstormy. But anyway, let's talk about what this Eric Thoughts is about. As you can see from the title, it's 100 vlog, it's giveaway day. So I thought I'd take this opportunity to do a couple of things. One, thank you guys. And two, just talk about what the journey's been like so far. I made a little uh, vlog probably one of the first ones one of the first 20 anyway i just what it's like to vlog i think it was a month maybe 30 but what it's like to vlog and i had still had no idea and really i still don't but i'm going to share my thoughts and ideas anyway on the subject so let's start with what the journey has been like so from those og viewers back in the first few vlogs a couple of them well i wouldn't really call the first few vlogs really they were just videos based on the footage I had lying around on the computer or films I've, or video I've filmed and wanted to make into a video but just hadn't really got around to it. And it was all down to the fact that I ended up with glandular fever, or mono, whatever you want to call it, and then tonsillitis too. That gave me, or it opened the opportunity for me to essentially just sit down and be like, okay i need something to do here i'm not just gonna sit here and watch netflix i'm not gonna sit here and play fortnite 24 7 i mean maybe 12 7 but not 24 7 and i thought okay let's make these videos and as you can see from the like i said the og viewers know those first few vlogs uh kind of strange not gonna lie so i've got the the video about Frozen was singing, Do You Want to Build a Snowman? That was strange. Uh, the one where I played the violin and cloned myself a few times, that was, uh, that was uh, different there. That was interesting. And, but, obviously I've graduated from those strange vlogs. I'm still strange, don't worry about that. And there'll be plenty of strange vlogs to come along in the future, but, I've kind of found my sort of my way and what I want to vlog and how I want my vlogs to be. There is a certain structure. Erg Thoughts certainly helps with that structure. I've got pretty much wake up. I've got the positions. Ooh, a chain whip there. I've got a position where I do some filming in the morning. Position where I like walk from the car to Leander Club. Obviously, I don't want to do that every single day and I do want to change that up. But the structure is there and it's set up so I can make these vlogs every day and get content out to you guys. And it's been so exciting. Your responses have been so good. It's been so positive in the last 100 days. Like I was expecting to make a couple videos, make just have some fun, and then that would be it. But what part of it is that you guys have been so positive and so responsive, especially all the uni crews out there, Exeter, Dundee, like all of those unis, <laughs> all I mentioned too. But Pretty much everybody that DMs me on Instagram, everybody that comments on the videos, I pretty much re I do reply to pretty much every single one of you guys, and I read them and try and respond, not just with yeah, buddy or or wow, we, but sometimes obviously some responses that are like yeah, buddy fits, but it's really good to have such a community that's building to really follow along these, with these vlogs and I, and just following you guys along as well. Just hearing your stories, letting, see if I'm going to help you guys out. It's just, it just, it's added something just special. Something special has been added to my life because of these vlogs and because of you guys. And I mentioned, since we're talking about this anyway, it is as a great big thank you to everyone that's watching the vlogs on the reg, or even if you've just joined us. But it's all thanks to you guys that I've had, I've had, I'm having so much fun and these vlogs haven't been sort of, I've had a lot of questions about 
oh you're you're on your hundredth vlog you're probably only going to, going to go to the 102 105 but i'm not getting fed up at all of making these touch wood obviously but i didn't expect to make 100 i didn't expect to make 20 actually but i'm, I'm keeping going and at the rate in which i am progressing and even just editing i don't know when i'm going to stop but we'll see obviously i can't tell the future and if, if the community is as positive as it is this whole time and we can all work together and help create content then i think it'll be a great success and a great future vlogging experience for me and hopefully you guys can follow my experiences as well and obviously for again from those og viewers You've watched me go from 159s on the, or even from 110 on the walk bike, struggling a bit for UT2, then hopping on the Erg for the first time after getting my tonsils out, doing 158s, 159s. Now we're sitting down in the low 50s. We're almost back under 150 for UT2, and we're heading towards my goal UT2 split in the sort of mid 140s. We're getting there, but that's going to take time, and we do have time. But I'm hoping that you guys stick with me on my journey and we can see what we can do together. And since you've kept with me up to this stage, for those OG viewers, or all those new viewers that have joined recently, but may not know the answer, maybe you could go back to the vlogs and find out. For those viewers that want to find out or already know the answer to this question, I'm going to do a separate giveaway to the main giveaway for the people who have listened through this to this part of the video. So I have a few spare, hashtag chase the blow tank tops that I made last year. So I'm gonna give at least one of those away to one of the lucky commenters on this video, but the comment has to have the word of the thing that in the original vlogs, from the first maybe 20 or so, I was buying, in the vlogs anyway, I was buying every day. If you, under, if you know, you know. So if you comment, the comment has to have that word in it, and that will also get you entered into the main giveaway as well. So comment, like, subscribe for the main giveaway. And if you want to be entered into the sub giveaway for the hashtag chase the blow tank top. And if you've listened, listened this far, excellent. To get that hashtag chase the blow tank top to be entered into that. Your comment has to contain the word describing the thing that I had to buy, Adam and I had to buy every day in the original vlogs, or the first sort of 20 vlogs. I'm, I'm, the purchasing is still happening, but I don't film it every day. But I'm hoping that you guys understand what I'm talking about here. Otherwise, this would be a bit strange of a discussion. But again, thank you guys. The journey has been awesome so far to the 100th vlog. Epic journey. And I'm looking forward to get to 1,000. But as Fraser sort of films my uh, paddling pool beneath me, it is uh, quite a sight. And like I said, I'll mention how much I actually lost once I get off the air. But thank you very much for listening, guys and girls. I'll see you after I'm finished this air. And now had a shower, changed from that 18k on the ergometer, hopefully enjoyed erg thoughts. But just weighed myself after the erg, I have lost 3.1 kilos during the sweatiest erg I have done in a long, long time. Because it's very humid in here and I was just wanting to add to it. Just keep going. So I added 3 kilos of water to the air and the ground. Now I have to drink approximately 6 litres of water 
to get back the hydration I've now lost. So it's going to be a big lunch. Let's get to it. Because food is fuel! It is lunchtime. We have the fuel slash food. Now it's time to put it in one bowl. <laughs> time to eat. And a fantastic lunchtime break there. Had made a little longer since I sweated out so much fluid during that 18k on the ergometer. So I'm drinking up, eating up. Because food is fuel, had to get quite a bit of fuel in that lunchtime. Head to weights now. That is us finished with the weightlifting for today. Very exciting with Tunin and Fraser Christie. Tunin Oliver. Great times doing all the exercises, getting sweaty again. Lost so much weight during that ergo. Lost more weight during this just from sweat alone, but gaining it back on for them gain, train gains. All right. Remember, this is the 100th vlog, and to celebrate said 100th vlog, there is a giveaway helped along by the guys at Ninja. To enter the giveaway and win, or be in the chance to win, one of their awesome blenders that I have now been using to upgrade my smoothie game, you have to do three things. Three very simple things. One, comment on this video. Whatever you like, let me know how your day is. Let me know your favorite smoothie. Let me know whatever you like, but let's keep it PG. Hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And that's all you have to do to be in for a chance to win the smoothie maker slash blender slash thing, spinny blades and stuff from Ninja Smoothie Maker Blender people. All right. In Sunday's vlog, that's vlog 103, I'm going to announce the winner, so I'm going to randomly choose the winner from the comments on this video. Fingers crossed for you guys. I will not be entering for myself. But one of you will win, and I'll randomly pick that and announce that on Sunday's vlog. All right. Okay, and that is it for the rest of the vlog. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And as always, hit that like button, not just for the 100th vlog. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already, not just for the 100th vlog. And as a special 100th vlog, have a good one.